Hi all. So I am again here with an other topic in AS400. So that's uh, uh, how to check from a CL program if a job is active or not. So for this purpose, we have an API QUSR job API job I, which we can use uh, in a way from CL program to find whether the job is active or not. So let's see. Uh, I created one program where I am calling this QSR job API. So I declare the input parameters to this API. Here I am using the format job i0100 and all other things are kept as blank. Job name is a star uh, since I am passing the current job. So I am basically trying to get the, uh, the status for the current job in which this program will run. So let's and then I am you can see then I am uh, returning the job status from whatever we received in the receiver variable from the API in position 51 till length 10. So that will be then sent to the program message Q and will be displayed on the screen if called from the command line. So let's compile this program. program compiled successfully let's debug Let's put the breakpoint at line number one. Then call this program QNA9. So you can see at the receiver variable we received this job name, job user, and job number. And then at the 51 position we received star active till length 10 you can see all other uh, are blanks so let's see what is job status active so this job is active because this is the current job so now let's pass the some bad job details for example I'm submitting a job call q and a 8 and this is just a test job so i'll put this job on hold so you can see this job work user job this job is in job queue and its status is held so let's call this program what I'll do I'll change the job name from here well and job name so the job name would be like uh, um, first you will mention the job name this job One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. and from this position we will be mentioning the username 4 6 7 8 9 10 then from here we will mention the job number so in this way the, uh, the first 10 positions would be the job name and then the username next 10 positions and the next 6 position will be job number. So you will be assigning the job like this. You can see you have job details like this and now you will be receiving the job details. You can see that's in job queue. 
जॉब स्टेटस इज करेंटली जॉब क्यू सो यूजिंग दिस वे यू हैव सी सी इन दैट हाउ आई चेक दैट इफ अ जॉब इज एक्टिव और नॉट फ्रॉम अ सी एल प्रोग्राम सो वी कैन यूज दिस ए पी आई टू डू वेरियस थिंग्स सो दैट्स ऑल इन दिस वीडियो थैंक यू एंड हैव अ नाइस टाइम